Eat now. These types of meat that enhance blood circulation you may not know. Have you ever wondered if the types of meat you consume could actually boost your blood circulation? Are you unknowingly missing out on crucial information that could significantly improve your overall health? Let's delve into the realm of blood flow. According to the American Heart Association, maintaining optimal blood circulation is paramount for good health. Poor blood flow can lead to various health issues, including cardiovascular diseases. In fact, approximately 655,000 Americans died from heart disease, accounting for about one in every four deaths annually. In our previous discussions, we've explored fruits that improve blood circulation. Now, it's time to shift our focus towards the lesser-known types of meat that can actually enhance your blood flow. It's essential to recognize that dietary choices play a significant role in our overall well-being. While some meats may seem ordinary, their impact on blood circulation could be extraordinary. By understanding and incorporating the right types of meat into your diet, you can actively contribute to improving your blood flow and, consequently, your health. Stay tuned until the end of this video. Don't miss out on this valuable knowledge that could transform your health for the better. Let's begin our exploration with the first meat on our list. 1. Okay. Skinless Chicken Breast Skinless chicken breast is rich in lean protein, which contains amino acids like arginine and citrulline. These compounds are known to promote the production of nitric oxide in the body, leading to vasodilation and improved blood circulation. For instance, a 100-gram serving of skinless chicken breast provides approximately 31 grams of protein, contributing significantly to the daily requirement for amino acids essential for vascular health. Skinless chicken breast also contains nutrients like vitamin B6, niacin, and iron, which play crucial roles in supporting cardiovascular function and overall blood flow. Vitamin B6 helps regulate homocysteine levels, reducing the risk of blood vessel damage and improving circulation. Niacin, on the other hand, aids in dilating blood vessels and enhancing blood flow, while iron supports the production of healthy red blood cells necessary for oxygen transport. To enhance skinless chicken breast, consider brining it before cooking. Brining involves soaking the chicken in a mixture of water, salt, and sometimes sugar, which tenderizes the meat and keeps it moist, resulting in juicier chicken. Citrus-based marinades, like lemon or lime juice, add tanginess and tenderize the chicken due to their acidic properties. Butterflying the chicken horizontally creates thinner pieces, reducing cooking time and ensuring even cooking. Lastly, Seasoning with herbs and spices such as thyme, rosemary, or paprika adds flavor without excessive salt or unhealthy sauces. These techniques make skinless chicken breast more flavorful and nutritious for any meal. Moving to the next type of meat that enhances blood circulation, are there any lean poultry options known for their health benefits? 2. Turkey Turkey is a powerhouse of nutrients that can significantly enhance blood circulation due to its high content of vitamin B6 and niacin. Vitamin B6 plays a crucial role in hemoglobin production, which carries oxygen in the blood. Niacin helps dilate blood vessels, promoting better blood flow. Additionally, turkey is rich in iron, which is essential for red blood cell production. For example, a 3-ounce serving of roasted turkey breast contains approximately 0.7 mg of vitamin B6, 6.5 mg of niacin, and 1.5 mg of iron. Furthermore, the amino acid content in turkey, particularly arginine, aids in blood vessel dilation, thereby improving circulation. Arginine promotes the production of nitric oxide, a molecule that relaxes blood vessels, allowing for better blood flow. Additionally, the low fat content in turkey compared to other meats reduces the risk of arterial plaque buildup, further supporting healthy circulation. When preparing turkey, opt for lean cuts and avoid excessive frying or cooking with added fats. Grilling, baking, or roasting are healthier cooking methods that retain the nutritional benefits of turkey without adding unnecessary fats. Incorporating herbs and spices like garlic, rosemary, and turmeric not only enhances flavor but also adds antioxidants that support cardiovascular health. Additionally, pairing turkey with fiber-rich vegetables and whole grains can further boost its circulatory benefits. Moving to types of meats known for enhancing blood circulation, what distinct qualities does this particular option offer in terms of cardiovascular health benefits? 3. Lean Beef 
Lean beef contains a unique compound known as iron, which plays a crucial role in enhancing blood circulation by supporting the production of hemoglobin. Hemoglobin carries oxygen from the lungs to tissues throughout the body, including the legs, promoting circulation and overall cardiovascular health. Additionally, lean beef is rich in protein, which supports muscle health and contributes to the repair and maintenance of blood vessels. For example, a 3-ounce serving of lean beef provides approximately 2.1 mg of iron, meeting about 12% of the daily value. Moreover, lean beef contains significant amounts of zinc and vitamin B12, which are essential for the proper functioning of red blood cells and the maintenance of blood vessel integrity. Zinc aids in the synthesis of proteins and DNA, while vitamin B12 supports the production of red blood cells, both of which are vital for optimal blood circulation. For optimal preparation and consumption of lean beef to enhance blood circulation, it's essential to choose lean cuts, such as sirloin, tenderloin, or round cuts, which are lower in saturated fats. These cuts provide ample protein, iron, zinc, and vitamin B12, crucial nutrients for supporting red blood cell production and maintaining blood vessel health. When cooking lean beef, it's advisable to employ cooking methods that minimize added fats, such as grilling, broiling, or baking, instead of frying. Additionally, marinating the beef with herbs, spices, and citrus juices not only enhances flavor but also helps tenderize the meat without relying on excessive fats or salt. Moving to the next topic, what are the unique qualities of this particular lean cut of meat, often recognized for its tenderness and low fat content? 4. Pork Tenderloin Pork tenderloin contains a unique combination of nutrients that contribute to enhancing blood circulation, such as iron, zinc, and B vitamins. Iron plays a crucial role in producing hemoglobin, which carries oxygen in the blood. Additionally, zinc helps in the formation of new blood vessels, while B vitamins support overall cardiovascular health. These nutrients work synergistically to promote optimal blood flow throughout the body. Moreover, pork tenderloin is rich in protein, which supports muscle function and repair. Amino acids found in protein are essential for maintaining the integrity of blood vessels and ensuring smooth blood flow. Furthermore, the lean nature of pork tenderloin reduces the intake of saturated fats, which can contribute to improved cardiovascular health and blood circulation. When preparing pork tenderloin to enhance blood circulation, prioritize lean cuts and trim visible fat. Incorporate heart-healthy herbs and spices like garlic, rosemary, thyme, and ginger into marinades for added flavor and antioxidants. Marinate with citrus juices such as lemon or lime, rich in vitamin C and flavonoids that support blood vessel function. Choose cooking methods like grilling, baking, or roasting over frying to minimize added fats. These strategies optimize the nutritional value of pork tenderloin, promoting better blood circulation. Last but not least, moving to fish high in omega-3 fatty acids, what cooking methods can be employed to maximize their blood circulation benefits while maintaining their nutritional value? 5. Fatty fish Fatty fish, such as salmon and mackerel, contain high levels of omega-3 fatty acids, specifically icosapentaenoic acid, EPA, and dicosahexaenoic acid, DHA. These fatty acids play a crucial role in enhancing blood circulation by reducing inflammation and preventing blood clot formation. Omega-3 fatty acids also promote the production of nitric oxide, a compound that helps dilate blood vessels, improving blood flow throughout the body. For instance, a 3-ounce serving of cooked salmon provides approximately 1.1 grams of EPA and DHA combined. In addition to omega-3 fatty acids, fatty fish are rich in protein, which supports muscle health. Maintaining muscle mass is essential for optimal blood circulation, as muscles help pump blood back to the heart. Moreover, the vitamin D content in fatty fish contributes to cardiovascular health by regulating blood pressure and reducing the risk of arterial stiffness. When preparing fatty fish, it's essential to focus on cooking methods that preserve its nutritional value. Grilling or baking fatty fish with minimal added fats helps retain its omega-3 fatty acids, which are crucial for enhancing blood circulation. For added flavor and health benefits, consider marinating the fish in a mixture of lemon juice, garlic, and herbs before cooking. Pairing fatty fish with vegetables rich in vitamins and minerals, such as leafy greens or tomatoes, further boosts its cardiovascular benefits. 
In conclusion, neglecting the significance of the types of meats that enhance blood flow can have profound consequences for our circulatory system. The choices we make regarding our diet directly impact blood circulation, which in turn affects our overall health. Disregarding the importance of consuming meats that promote healthy blood flow may lead to issues such as poor circulation, increased risk of cardiovascular diseases, and related conditions. On the contrary, being mindful of the types of meats we consume and incorporating those that support optimal blood circulation can bring about significant benefits for our cardiovascular health. If you found the information in this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. Your support means a lot to us. Stay tuned for our next video where we delve deeper into various beverages that can enhance blood circulation, some of which you may have already consumed without realizing their remarkable effects. Don't miss out on discovering these magical elixirs that can boost your overall health and well-being. Watch out! 5 Types of Meat Causing Blood Circulation Blockage have you ever stopped to think about how your daily meat consumption could be silently wreaking havoc on your arteries? Prepare to be stunned by what we're about to reveal. Did you know that artery blockage, a condition commonly associated with heart disease, is a leading cause of serious health issues? According to the American Heart Association, the prevalence of heart disease is alarmingly high, approximately 121.5 million people each year, which is nearly one in three people. These statistics underscore the urgent need to address the dangers of clogged arteries and the impact of diet on blood flow. But did you realize that your choice of meat could be a significant contributor to artery blockage? It's a frightening reality that demands our attention. In today's video, we'll explore five types of meat that, if consumed daily, could significantly increase your risk of developing clogged arteries. By identifying and eliminating these harmful dietary habits, you can take proactive steps to protect your arteries and reduce your risk of heart disease. If you're concerned about your heart health and want to avoid the dangers of clogged arteries, then this video is a must-watch. Don't leave yet, watch till the end because at the conclusion of the video, I have a secret gift I want to share with you. Now, let's start with number 1. 1. Red Meat Red meats such as beef, lamb, and pork are rich in saturated fats and cholesterol, particularly if they are not lean cuts. Consuming excessive amounts of red meat has been associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular disease. The primary cause behind the development of clogged arteries from consuming red meat lies in its high saturated fat content, particularly in fatty cuts like ribeye or T-bone steak. Saturated fats can raise LDL cholesterol levels, leading to the buildup of plaque in arterial walls. For instance, a 3-ounce serving of ribeye steak contains approximately 6 grams of saturated fat, surpassing the recommended daily limit. Additionally, red meat consumption is associated with an increased intake of heme iron, which may promote oxidative stress and inflammation in blood vessels, further contributing to arterial blockages. These factors make red meat a significant contributor to cardiovascular disease risk, setting it apart from other foods in this regard. Beyond its high saturated fat and heme iron content, red meat also contains compounds like advanced glycation end products, AGES, and trimethylamine N oxide, TMAO, which have been linked to impaired blood vessel function and increased cardiovascular risk. AGES, formed during high-temperature cooking processes, can promote inflammation and oxidative stress in the arteries. Meanwhile, TMAO, a byproduct of gut bacteria metabolism from dietary choline and carnitine found in red meat, has been associated with accelerated atherosclerosis and plaque formation. Moving to our next point, what aspects of cured and preserved meats contribute to the development of clogged arteries, affecting cardiovascular health too? Processed meats. Okay. Processed meats, such as bacon, sausages, and deli meats, contain high levels of saturated fats, cholesterol, and sodium, which contribute to the development of clogged arteries. For instance, just one serving of bacon, around one ounce, contains approximately 30 mg of cholesterol and 200 mg of sodium. These substances promote the accumulation of plaque in the arteries, narrowing the blood vessels and impeding blood flow. Moreover, processed meats often undergo curing, smoking, or salting processes, which can introduce harmful chemicals like nitrites and nitrates that further exacerbate arterial blockages. 
processed meats are also associated with increased inflammation and oxidative stress in the body, both of which are risk factors for cardiovascular diseases. The high levels of preservatives, additives, and trans fats in processed meats can trigger inflammatory responses and damage the delicate lining of blood vessels, leading to impaired circulation. Additionally, the excess sodium content in these meats can raise blood pressure, further straining the cardiovascular system and promoting arterial plaque formation. Moving to our next consideration, what are some other types of high-fat animal protein sources that may pose a risk for developing clogged arteries and cardiovascular issues? 3. Fatty Cuts of Meat Cuts of meat with visible fat marbling, such as ribeye steak and pork belly, are high in saturated fats. Regular consumption of fatty cuts of meat can raise LDL cholesterol levels and contribute significantly to the development of clogged arteries. For instance, a 100-gram serving of beef brisket can contain up to 14 grams of saturated fat and 90 milligrams of cholesterol. These substances can accumulate in the arteries over time, forming plaques that narrow the blood vessels and impede blood flow. Unlike lean cuts of meat, such as skinless chicken breast, fatty cuts pose a greater risk of cardiovascular issues due to their adverse impact on cholesterol levels and arterial health. Moreover, the consumption of fatty cuts of meat is associated with increased inflammation and oxidative stress in the body, further exacerbating arterial damage. Research suggests that the consumption of processed and red meats, especially those high in saturated fats, is linked to a higher risk of coronary artery disease and other cardiovascular complications. Additionally, the presence of harmful compounds like heterocyclic amines and polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons in grilled or charred meats can contribute to arterial plaque formation. Moving to our next consideration, what about the consumption of animal organs, known for their unique nutritional profiles and potential impact on arterial health? Okay. 4. Organ meats Organ meats like liver and kidneys, although rich in certain nutrients, contain high levels of saturated fats and cholesterol, contributing to the development of clogged arteries. For instance, a single serving of beef liver, about 100 grams, contains approximately 450 milligrams of cholesterol, exceeding the recommended daily intake. Moreover, organ meats are dense in arachidonic acid, a type of omega-6 fatty acid that can promote inflammation and arterial plaque buildup when consumed excessively. This unique composition makes organ meats a significant contributor to arterial blockages, increasing the risk of cardiovascular diseases such as atherosclerosis. In addition to their high cholesterol and saturated fat content, organ meats often harbor environmental toxins and pollutants, further compromising cardiovascular health. These toxins accumulate in the organs of animals over time, posing additional risks to consumers. Furthermore, the high levels of iron found in organ meats can catalyze oxidative stress and promote endothelial dysfunction, impairing blood vessel function and circulation. 5. Processed Poultry Processed poultry, such as breaded chicken nuggets and fried chicken, often contains high levels of sodium and saturated fats, contributing to the development of clogged arteries. These products are typically laden with preservatives, additives, and excess salt, which can lead to hypertension and arterial plaque buildup. For instance, a single serving of processed chicken nuggets may contain up to 400 mg of sodium, nearly one-fifth of the recommended daily limit. The combination of sodium and unhealthy fats in processed poultry can elevate LDL cholesterol levels and promote inflammation, accelerating the progression of atherosclerosis. Beyond the well-known risks of saturated fats and sodium, processed poultry also harbors hidden dangers that impede blood flow. Nitrites and nitrates, commonly used as preservatives in these products, have been linked to endothelial dysfunction and increased risk of cardiovascular disease. Additionally, the cooking methods employed in processing, such as frying and high-temperature grilling, can generate harmful compounds like heterocyclic amines and polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, further compromising vascular health. So we've delved into meats that can clog arteries. Now, as promised earlier, I have a gift for you. I'm going to share some types of meats that are good for arteries and how to prepare them. First up is salmon, a fish rich in omega-3 fatty acids that help reduce inflammation and lower the risk of heart disease. Opt for wild-caught salmon for the highest omega-3 content. You can grill or bake salmon with seasonings like lemon, garlic, and herbs for a heart-healthy meal. Next is skinless chicken, a high-quality protein source low in saturated fat. 
removing the skin reduces saturated fat content. Marinate chicken with a mixture of olive oil, lemon juice, and spices, then grill or roast until cooked through. Pair with steamed greens for a nutritious dinner. Third is lean beef, selecting lean cuts like sirloin or tenderloin and trimming excess fat before cooking to reduce fat content. Marinate beef with a mixture of balsamic vinegar, garlic, and onions, then grill or broil to perfection. Serve with a side of roasted vegetables for a heart-healthy meal. Lastly, ground turkey. Skinless ground turkey is another excellent choice for heart health. Ground turkey can be used as a substitute for ground beef in dishes like burgers, meatballs, or chili. Season ground turkey with spices and herbs to enhance flavor without the need for excess oil or salt. By incorporating these meats into your daily diet and preparing them using healthy cooking methods, you can support artery health and reduce the risk of heart disease. Remember to focus on whole foods and limit added fats and sodium for optimal heart health. Thank you for joining us in this eye-opening exploration of the detrimental effects of consuming five types of meat that can lead to clogged arteries. We've shed light on how these meats can compromise your health in the long run. If you found this video helpful, don't hesitate to show your support by hitting the like button, sharing it with your friends and family, and subscribing to our channel for more insightful content. Your engagement fuels our mission to spread awareness and knowledge about healthier living. We hope this information empowers you to make wiser dietary decisions not only for yourself but also for your loved ones. By avoiding these unhealthy meats, you're taking a significant step towards a healthier lifestyle. Let's continue to build a community dedicated to making informed choices for a happier, healthier life. Stay tuned for more valuable insights, and until next time, prioritize your health with every meal. Thank you once again for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.